Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Peter Olwoch. I'm a stock market researcher and investor. I'm also a cryptocurrency researcher and investor. Today's topic is this. How much returns should you aim for in a year? How much returns should you aim for in a year? I'm in a telegram group and the name of my telegram group is called Stock Market Investing 101. So there we discuss everything finances. We discuss the stock market. We discuss commodities market like gold and silver. We discuss cryptocurrency market. We discuss uh, synthetic indices. We discuss forex. We discuss NFTs. We discuss virtually everything. So someone said that uh, Bitcoin EFTs, we, uh, there's another company that is offering about 24% return per year. And so investors are being lured to go for 24% returns per year. Ladies and gentlemen, 24% returns per year seems like good money. But uh, if you consider inflation... And if you consider taxes that Zakayo is putting on us, 24% return in a year may not seem like a good return. A good return that you should seek for, and it's not easy to find, for me as a farmer, is 100% return. The reasoning is very simple. If you have a goat, or if you are rearing goats and sheep, those animals, in most cases, you will find that they'll produce triplets or twins. A Bible story is told where Laban was uh, staying with one of his nephews. And uh, the guy he was staying with, Joseph, I think a story of uh, Laban, Lab, Lab, Laban and... Uh, I'm forgetting the story. The story is about Laban and uh, I think Joseph. Huh? Not Joseph. Isaac. Not Isaac. Laban and somebody here. I'm forgetting the, the Bible story. But the story is told that the sheep of the cousin would produce in triplets and quadruplets and the goats would produce again in the same number quadrets quadruplets and triplets and by doing that yes the, the story was about Esau and his brother Jacob so this man his sheep became more and more and more and more in normal life even if you plant maize, one seedling of maize, one seed of maize, one seed of maize will produce almost 200 maize seeds. If you plant one seed of a mango, it will produce more seeds. That is the nature of life. Even animals... Animals like goats, for example, or sheep, for example, or a dog, for example, or pigs, for example. One pig would produce more piglets. So the story of life or the story of nature is that you should expect more returns. We human beings, we have been conditioned to accept less returns. Ladies and gentlemen, don't agree to accept less returns. There is returns of about 7% given by banks or 10% given by circles. This is an abuse. You should not accept such low returns. Go for the jugular. Go for trading. Trade stocks. Trade crypto. Trade forex. Trade synthetic indices. Aim for 100% return in a year. Aim for 200% returns in a year. Aim for 300% returns in a year. Anything less than that is not acceptable. 
ladies and gentlemen today that is today's my video aim for higher returns in investing don't aim for less if you are aiming for less you are shooting yourself in the feet otherwise thank you so much my name is peter watch i'm a stock market research and investor i'm also a cryptocurrency research and investor you can call me my telephone number is 0720 you can call me my telephone number is 0720 call me i'll guide you i'll mentor you i'll teach you stock market and investing for free call me send me a whatsapp message i'll guide you free stock market and cryptocurrency training for 30 days send me a whatsapp message my telephone number is 0720 969 361 thank you so much